brought to life by this machine. They're using it. Using me to search for something. Call it the apple. It's an artifact. One of many so-called pieces of Eden. Templars collect it. It's how they stay in power. And if the Templars get their hands on another one, everything will change. They want to make us all their slaves. When they first brought me here, I was afraid of what would happen if I tried to fight back. Now? Now I'm afraid of what will happen if I don't. But I can't do it alone. And maybe I don't have to. I met someone. Her name is Lucy. I think she's on my side. But she's gone now. She's taken away by that bastard Warren Vidic and his Templar masters. I don't know what will happen to her. Or what'll happen to me. All I know is I need to get out of here. And I need to do it soon. My name is Desmond Miles. And this is my story. Okay. We have to go. Lucy, where have you been? Why did they- Now. It's time to speed run this crap. Get in. What's with the blood? Are you okay? Look, we have maybe 10 minutes, maybe, before they figure out what I've done. If we're not out of here and on the road before then- Wait, we're leaving? Desmond, I promise I'll answer all of your questions. Later. But right now, I need you to just shut up and do what I say. So please, get in the Animus. All right. Hurry up, Desmond. We're running out of time. Okay. Ah, crap. I need press, 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 press buttons. Can't get distracted. Can't. I, I was at the bank when they told me. Did I miss it? Am I too late? Uh -huh. Give him here. Giovanni. Shh, my love. It will be all right. Tu sei un auditore. Sei un combattente. Perciò combatti. Getting through all this. Okay. Listen to him. A fine set of lungs. And what shall we call him, my love? Ezio. Ezio Auditore da Firenze.
Hey, what happened to your lab coat? Give me one second, I need to do something Wait quickly. Up. We need to move. Coming, I'm coming. Come on, Desmond. Hey, what happened to your lab coat? Hey, what happened to your lab coat? Hurry up! Wait up! I am hurrying. Good grief. We need to move. Coming, oh. I'm coming. I'm due. What happened to your lab coat? Hurry up! Wait up! We need to move. Coming, I'm coming. There we go. Come on, Desmond. Now I can get a move on. Really getting out of here, huh? Sturgo's got some fucked up interior decorators. Stay close. Hey! They're not supposed to be up here! Open this door! I'm calling it in! We have a breach in the research wing. I repeat, there's been a breach in the research Come wing. Come on, Desmond, let's go. backup from all available security personnel. Subjects appear to be armed. Walls. Fancy. There they are! Don't let them get away! <laughs> Holy shit! Hey. Moving, moving, moving. What about the cameras? I rigged them to loop old footage. How do you think I managed to hide all your nighttime snooping from Abstergo? You're good. So I've been told. But they're on to us now. We need to hurry. We need to get to that elevator on the other side of the room. Follow my lead, but keep an eye out for security. I'd rather avoid a fight. Is that an animus? Are there? Hold on. Is it animuses or animi? What do you think, Lucy? Lucy, what do they need with all of them? Desmond, shut the fuck up. Please. Fuck. I thought this card would work. It must be on a separate system, and I don't have the code. 
Wait. How did you do that? I don't know. Let's go. It's always something. What was that in the Animus? Subject 16? Ezio, Audi, Audi something? I think we've been wrong all along. That's why we need to get out of here. Vidic and the Templars, they're only part of the problem. What do you mean? I'll explain when we get there. Get where? Joke. It's for your own protection. Oh, man. We're almost there. Thanks for that. It's great. Shoving the trunk, bouncing around. Love this it. way. So, you want to tell me what's going on now? There was a reason for the escape, Desmond. Figures. We need your help. I know. For what? what? Another treasure hunt through time? Abstergo is a place their apple of Eden. The map no, your ancestor found guarantees it. The other assassins, they'll do what they can, where they can, but. What? <coughs> what is it? It's war, Desmond. The Templars are too powerful. And every day, more of us die. I still don't see how I fit into things. Up here, up here. We're going to train you. We'll turn you into one of us. What? No. No, you've seen me in action. I'm no good at this. And even if I was... <laughs> Why are you laughing, Sarah? <laughs> no. Not with the Animus. Not with the bleeding effect. Are you laughing at me? I'm just one guy. Okay. Sometimes, that's all you need. So that's why you found him. My ancestor. What was his name? Ezio? If you can follow in his footsteps, you'll learn everything he did, just like he did. Years of training Dang absorbed it. in a matter of you days. slow. You broke me out of Abstergo and so brought me here just to make me an assassin? Now I'm slow. <laughs> Look, there's more to it than that, but it'll have to wait. Trust me, okay? All right, I'm in. Tell me what you need. Really? You're sure? I thought you'd be happy about this. Sorry, I'm just a little surprised. I spent the whole ride over here figuring out how I was going to convince you to do this. Save it. After what those Templar bastards put me through, I'm ready, willing, and able. Thank you. I can't. Lucy, you made it. God, it's been so long. Seven years. Okay. Can you believe it? Indeed. Welcome back. Ah, so this must be the infamous subject. So. Seventeen. Desmond Miles, was it? Who are you? I'm sorry. Where are my manners? I'm Sean Hastings. This is Rebecca Crane. 
Nice to meet you, Desmond. Right, well, it's been lovely chatting, but if you don't mind, Desmond, it's best we get straight to work. Time is precious. Doubly so these days. But we've got everything set up and ready, Lucy. Just say the word and we'll get going. Here, I brought you something. A parting gift from Abstergo. Whoa! The memory core! This is amazing. With their data, things are gonna go a lot faster. I'll get to work on merging the code. Hey, Desmond. What's up? Just wondering what your role is in all this. I take care of Baby. It's my job to keep her up and running. Baby? You mean the Animus? Actually, I prefer Animus 2.0, since Baby's twice as awesome as anything you'll find at Abstergo. The Templars might have deeper pockets than us, but they've got no ambition, no passion, no competitive edge. That's why, even with all their resources, anything they can do, I can do better. Faster, too. Anyway, Take a seat when you're ready, and we can get started. I just need to make a few more adjustments. Okay. Hey, listen. I just wanted to say thank you. And, uh, I'm sorry. Sorry? Yeah, you know, before. Everything at Abstergo. It was just... I wasn't ready. It's okay. No. Going through all that. Knowing that the Templars still exist, what they're planning. What's done is done, Desmond. You're here now, and that's what matters. What's all this stuff for? This stuff, Desmond. Oh, this stuff is nothing special, really, this stuff. It's just the stuff that keeps our entire operation from falling apart, really. It requires a great deal of concentration to keep it all moving, so you'll forgive me if I don't have time to play meet and greet. Sean's in charge of maintaining our knowledge archives. It's like a digital library. He'll be riding shotgun with me while you're in the Animus. So if you come across anything of note, people, places, events, etc., he'll create database entries you can consult for additional information. Yeah, it's not just databases, though. I also provide tactical support for the other assassins. You know, Desmond, the ones who are out there, actually doing stuff, risking their lives, little things like that. Salty much? Gee. So, how does this work? Of course. Deep breath. Ah! Oh, what are you, a tiny child? Sean! Well... Here we go. Insieme per la vittoria! Insieme! Insieme. 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 Ah. Silenzio, my friends! Silenzio! Grazie! Do you know what brings us here tonight? Honor! Viere de Paxi slanders my family's name and forces his own miseries upon us. If we... Enough of your nonsense, Grullo! Sarah, we were just talking about you. Surprised to see you here. I thought the Patsy hired others to do their dirty work. 
It's your family that cries for guards when there's trouble. Gotardo. Afraid to handle things yourself? Your sister seemed quite satisfied with the handling I gave her earlier. Uccidetelo! <laughs> <laughs> Let's get brawling. Behind you, Ruth. Wow. You're actually not as big an idiot as you look. How many of them you can ruin before they get the best of you? It's not necessary. Besides, I've no money for this doctor of yours. <laughs> wasted it on women and wine, huh? I'd hardly call it wasted. Give me some floorings then. Or have you done the same? <laughs> <laughs> Search them. There's bound to be something in their pockets. should be enough. Let's get out of here before the guards arrive. Sorry, Ezio. The sooner we're done with the doctor, the sooner we can sleep. Hmm, fratelli auditori, why am I not surprised? You've made quite a mess of yourself, young man. It's nothing, really. You must help him. That pretty face is his only asset. 
fuck did he do? There we are. Now get out of here. Grazie. This way. Quite the night. Indeed. I only wish they were all as much fun. Oh, wait. They are. <laughs> We should head home, Ezio. Father's sure to be wondering where we've gone. Yes. I'd rather avoid a lecture. Up for a little race, then? To where? Uh, roof of that church. On the count of three. Uno, due, tre. Baby brother still has much to learn. Come on, Tartaruga. I'm not going to run this time. Still has much to learn. Come on, Tartaruga. <laughs> Come on, then. This way. Where are you going? You'll see. It is a good life we lead, brother. <sighs> the best. May it never change. And may it never change us. All right. Enough of that. We really should head home. Let's go. Wait. What? Ezio, let Christina sleep. There will be time enough for that later. Ah. See here, map. So it's Vieri. Better hide. Keep looking. He couldn't have gotten far. I'm in mission right now. Christina, 
Christina. There. Who's there? Me. Oh, it's you. I should have known. May I come in? Fine, but only for a minute. A minute is all I need. Indeed. <laughs> well, wait. It, it came out wrong. Right there. Come here. Oh. Oh, it's you. And this part. Oh, it's you. So terrible that Figlio d'un cane! What is this? Perdonate, messere! Chiedo venia! I'll kill you! Oh, no, no, that's not necessary. Guards! Guards! Voglio la sua testa! Ora! Well, There's say? really no need for violence. You have me confused with someone else. She needed some help with some things. I'm mostly innocent. Father, come with me. Is something wrong? Do you think me blind and deaf, son? I know all about your fight with Vieri di Pazzi last night, and then this little visit to Christina. Your behavior is unacceptable. It. It. It reminds me of myself when I was your age. I assume these misadventures won't interfere with your work today. No, Padre. Avete la mia parola. I've prepared some documents here for Lorenzo di Medici to review. Where did I need them delivered to him. With haste, Father. Return to me when it's done. One letter. Madre Santa, preserve me. 
for Messer Lorenzo. I'll see that he receives it when he returns. Returns? They've gone to Villa Carreggio, I'm afraid. They don't expect it back for at least another day. I'll let my father know. Noble prices for noble ways. Oh, I'm not fit for an emperor. And the price too much. Insomma, what's wrong with you, so? Show some respect. Up the good work. Biscero. <laughs> you. Well, that's. Hello, son. You remember my friend Uber. Good morning, Gonfaloniere Alberti. To you as well, young man. I trust you delivered the message. See, si, Padre. But it seems Lorenzo is out of town. Hmm. I did not anticipate this. What does it matter? So you wait another day or two. Listen, your mother and sister have been looking for you. I'll need you again in a little while, but for now, see if you can't help me. Are you sure? Yes, now if you'll excuse us. Good to see you, Ezio. Buongiorno, Ezio. Buongiorno a voi, madre. Come state? Sto bene. And you? Still recovering from last night? I have no idea what you're talking about. Of course not. <laughs> anyway, I have an errand to run. I'd like you to <sighs> okay. Un piacere. Come. It's not far from here. I'm going to... Let's not oh, play this game. Those guys are still there. He's ill of us. I could not allow him to continue. I'm sure he's having a hard time dealing with the accusations against his father. Francesco Di Pazzi is many things, 
and none of them good. But even I never suspected he'd be capable of murder. Who happened to him? I imagine there will be a trial. Will father speak at it? He'll have to. He's the one with the evidence. Still, I wish there was another way. You have nothing to fear. Everyone wants justice done. It is an unfortunate state of affairs, but it will pass. Here we are. Hello, Leonardo. Madonna Maria. This is my son, Ezio. Molto honorato. L'onore è mio. Let me go and fetch the paintings. I'll be right back. He's very talented. Imagino. Self-expression is vital to understanding and enjoying life. You should find an outlet. I have plenty of outlets. I meant besides vaginas. Mother. Back to your house then. Si, si. Ezio, help Leonardo, will you? So Ezio, what do you do? He's been working for his father. Ah, not to be a banker. For now. And you, are, was it? Truth be told, it's been difficult for me to settle. Painting is nice, but I often feel like my work lacks, I don't know, a purpose. Does that make sense? I'd rather contribute more practically, more directly. Architecture, perhaps, or anatomy. I'm not content merely to capture the world. I want to change it. Oh, Leonardo, I have no doubt you'll go on to do great things. Vi ringrazio, Madonna. That's kind of you. Thank you for your help, son. Don't let me keep you from your other duties. It was nice to meet you, Ezio. I hope our paths cross again. Anch'io. Hey, Claudia. How are you? You shouldn't keep things from me. It's Duccio. What of him? I think he's been unfaithful. Who told you this? The other girls. I thought they were my friends. Harpies. You're better off without them. I loved him. No, Claudia. You only thought you did. He should suffer for what he's done. Wait here. I'll go have a word with him. Find him? Oh, I'll find him, all right. I'm sorry. I find him. You, sir. I go, I go. Beat him up. Do you require a medical assistance? I'm not sure. Over here, Duccio. 
It's a beautiful... Okay. Nothing but the best for you, Amore mio. But what of Claudia? I thought you'd been promised to her. The father said I could do much better than an auditorium. Virbante! Come, let us walk a bit. What? I had something <gasps> else in mind. Oh, Duccio. Mm. Mm. Hey, Lurido Porco! Ezio, my friend. You insult my sister, parading around with this puttana. W what are you talking about? I saw the gift you gave her, all the things you said. Maybe your sister shouldn't be so stingy with her virtu. You broke her heart. Ha! <laughs> and now I'm going to break your face. You auditore is all toffee. But when it comes time for action... Ha! Questa faccenda. <laughs> You'll regret ever opening your mouth. I could have taught your sister a great many things. She's lucky to have had someone like me. Bastardo! Rawls. Here, Petruccio. You should be in bed. I want those feathers. What for? It's a secret. If I get them for you, when you go back inside. Yes, I promise. Quick time event. Let's get this one in order to... Let's get down. Grazie, brother. You still have a yeah, one right. piece. I will. In time. Uh, 
Ezio, come in, son. I need these packages delivered to associates of mine in the city. I also need you to retrieve a message for me from a pigeon coop not too far from here. Va bene. I'll get it done. Come back here when you're finished. There are some things we need to discuss. And please, my son, stay out of trouble. Hmm? Luckily. Listen well. I also have overstock. Uh, That's one. I have a delivery from Giovanni Adatore. Yes. Were you followed? No. Why would I be followed? Give me the package. Tell your father that they're moving tonight. He should as well. Who's moving? What's going on here? Wait! Come back! Explain yourself! Remember, it is only divertimento until someone breaks a leg. Would you not have to drink? Hold on. I thought that would be our man. Clear the strada! What? Where did he go? I see him! There! Tap your point get over here. Giovanni's kid? No, idiota. He just happens to look exactly like the man. Give it here. Don't worry, boy. We're not contagious. Least I'm not. Father? 
Federico! <gasps> Serezio! Thank God! What happened? Where is everyone? They took your father and brothers to the Palazzo della Signoria. To prison. And my mother. My sister. Ezio. Claudia. Are you all right? Yes, but mother... She's in shock. They... When she resisted... It's not safe here. Is there some place you can take them? Yes, yes! To my sisters. Good, do that. In the meantime, I'll go see my father. Be careful, Messer Ezio. The guards were looking for you as well. Ezio! Father! What's happened? Took a bit of a beating, but I'm all right. What of your mother and sister? Safe now. Aneta took them. Yes. Wait. You knew this would happen? Not the way it did, and not this soon. Doesn't matter now. What do you mean? Explain! There is no time. Listen closely. Return to the house. In my office is a hidden door. Use Game your talent close. to find it. Beyond lies a chest. Take everything you find inside. Much of it may seem strange to you, but all of it is important. Do you understand? Yes. Good. Among the contents is a letter, and with it some documents. I need you to take these documents to Mr. Roberto. He was with me in the office this morning. The Gonfalonieri, I remember. Now please, tell me what's happening. Are the Pazzi behind this? There was a note for you at the prison. It said, go, Ezio. Go now. What did all the cut clothes? Haven't I seen it? Better. Merda! Get him! I should have waited. But I didn't. Porca 
Okay. Hmm. Father said there was a door here. Roberto. Traditore! Hey, what's with the swords? Aren't you supposed to arrest me? No. What do you want this? For you to die! Well, that's not going to happen. So why don't we explore other options? There are no other options! Ezio Auditore? What are you doing here at this hour? It... I, I don't... Wait, child. Take a breath. Collect your thoughts. My father My and brothers have been in prison. Traitors go to bring you this. Ah... Uh, I see now. It's a misunderstanding, Ezio. I'll clear everything up. How? The documents you've given me contain evidence of a conspiracy against your family and against the city. I'll present these papers at their hearing in the morning, and they'll be released. Thank you, Signore. Of course, my child. Do you need a place to stay? You're more than welcome here. No, grazie. I'll meet you at the piazza. Don't worry, Ezio. Everything is going to be fine. Sure, everything's going to be fine. My butt. Everything's 
not fine. Yes, fine and dandy. Yeah, no. All who need aid are welcome here. Don't kid yourself. Don't kid yourself. Giovanni Auditore, you and your accomplices stand accused of the crime of treason. Have you any evidence to counter this charge? Yes, the documents that were delivered to you last night. I'm afraid I know nothing of these documents. He's lying! I need to get closer. In the absence of any compelling evidence to the contrary, I am bound to pronounce you guilty. You and your collaborators are hereby sentenced to death. You are a traitor, Roberto, and one of them. You may take our lives this day, but we will have yours in return. I swear we will! Father! Hey, grab the boy! He's one of them! I'll kill you for what you've done! Guards! Arrest him! Better run, boy. And fast. Running, running, running. Ow. man standing man 
has been. I've got a little request for you. I've identified several strange markings that I've discovered right across Renaissance Italy. Now, I don't know what they're doing there, but I want you to help me find out. Rebecca has marked their general location in the database with an eye icon, and she's made them glow as well. Keep an eye out. Serezio, thank God. I've been looking everywhere for you. I couldn't stop them, Annetta. I tried, I swear. But there were so many guards. Please, come with me. We need to get you off the streets. What of my mother and sister? They're safe. I'll bring you to them. No. It's too dangerous for us to travel together. Tell me where to go and I'll meet you there. My sister's house. Just north of the Duomo. I'm on my way. Sorry. Have a care with Fish in a barrel. and sink. Okay. Right. 
victorious. Another cell This is it. It is a pleasure to make your acquaintance, Messer Ezio. Annetta speaks quite highly of you. I can see why. I appreciate the kind words, Madonna. Ti prego. Call me Paola. Thank you for offering your home to my family, Paola. It was the least I could do. You must be tired. Perhaps you'd... No, grazie. Can't stay. Why? Where are you going? To kill Uberto Alberti. I understand your desire for vengeance, but the Gonfaloniere is a powerful man. You are not a killer, Ezio. Spare me the lecture. <sighs> I can make you one. And why are you going to teach me how to kill? I'm not. I'm going to teach you how to survive. Come. Even. Even if. This question One, is paramount in my profession. You? We must walk the streets freely, seen but unseen. You two must learn to blend like us and become one with the city's crowds. My girls will show you how. Are so good. I'm one of you, I'm one of you. Continue to blend in. <laughs> that you've learned to blend, I'll show you how to use it for more than just moving around. Let's teach you how to steal. Thief! Thief! Once you've stolen from someone, Ezio, you mustn't linger. <laughs> Two, three, 
far. And fine. You can go now, girls. Oh, do we have to? So innocent. He's cute. Now that you have learned how to approach the enemy, we need to find you a suitable okay. weapon. What would you have me use? Ah, but you already have the answer. Hey, my father's blade and bracer. How did you get them? <laughs> By using the same skills I've just taught you. It's not exactly in working condition. I assume you are familiar with Leonardo da Vinci. See, si. so how does a painter factor into this? He's far more than that. Bring him the pieces. You'll see. Before I go, one last question, if I may. Of course. Why have you given your aid so readily to me, a stranger? I too know betrayal. Run away.
Fancy. Fancy. expect to see you again. What with all that's happened? Ah, where are my manners? Welcome back. Now, how can I be of service? I was hoping you could repair something of mine. Of course. Come, this way. Que pasticho. Tutto santo giorno che cerco. Let me clear a space. All right, let's see it. Fascinating. I don't know, Ezio. Despite its age, the construction is rather advanced. I've never seen anything quite like it. I'm afraid there's not much I can do without the original plans. Mi dispiace. Wait, wait, wait. What are you doing? The contents of this page are encrypted. But if my theory is correct, based on these sketches, it may very well... It may very well what? Please, sit. Leonardo, I... Shh, shh, shh. Remarkable. If we transpose the letters and then select every third. There, it's finished. Huh? What's finished? The blade. I managed to decode that parchment of yours. It showed me exactly what to do. Now all that's left is to remove your ring finger. Really? I'm sorry, but this is how it must be done. The blade is designed to ensure the commitment of whoever wields it. Bene. Do it quickly. <laughs> I was only having fun, Ezio. Though the blade once required a sacrifice, it's been modified. You can keep your finger. Incredible. Yes, it is. Tell me. Do you have other pages like this? I'm sorry, only the one. Listen, if you ever do happen across another one of these, please, bring it to me. You have my word, and thank you for fixing this. It... By order of the Florentine Guard, open this door! Uh, just a moment. Wait here. Are you Leonardo da Vinci? Si. Okay. How may I be of service? I need you to answer some questions. Certainly. Okay. What seems to be the trouble? A witness claims to have seen you consorting with an enemy of the city. What? Me? Consorting? Preposterous. When was the last time you saw or spoke with Ezio Auditore? Who? Non fare il finto tonto! We know you were close with the family. Perhaps this will help to clear your head. Uh, ready to talk? What about now? Grazie, uh. <laughs> Ezio. Sorry about that. Uh, I've grown accustomed to their abuses. What of the body? Bring it inside and put it with the others. Others? The city gives them to me for research. Dear bears. Thank you, Leonardo, for everything. Anytime. And remember, if you find more of those strange pages, bring them to me. 
Should they contain new designs, I will upgrade I'll your like to figure. I like to find that out. Now, I really should be getting back to Paola. Porgile i miei omaggi. I need to get rid of the being notorious. Climb up. Poor, poor Ezio. You were gone for quite a while. Leonardo likes to talk. That he does, but I trust he did more than talk. I've given you the skills, Leonardo's given you the blade. All that remains is the deed. Where can I find Uberto? According to my girls, he'll be attending an unveiling tonight of Verrocchio's latest work. It will be held at the Santa Croce cloister. Watch over my mother and sister while I'm away. It's of course, it's story as if they were my own. Alberto Alberti, trusted friend of the Auditore family. According to the history books, this guy was a saint. He prosecuted murderers, rapists, the worst criminals. One of the best lawyers in Italy, he won every case, in spite of the fact that he was self-taught. Now, I found a back door into the Templar's database server. I've been combing it for some kind of smoking gun. I found it. Apparently, Uberto's family was evicted by the Medici Bank. Uberto's been aching for revenge ever since, and the Templars promised him support. Ezio's father was standing in the way, and Uberto was jealous of his influence over the Florentine government. Two birds with one stone, isn't it? It looks like Uberto used his election to the Signoria as his opportunity to strike. Uberto Alberti. Trusted friend of the oh, Alberta family. Hmm. Again with this, you have overstepped your bounds, Uberto. I need to find my way Who are you in. to speak of bounds? You, who have crowned yourself Lorenzo di Medici, Principe of Firenze. I've done no such thing. Of course not. Ever innocent. How convenient. 
At least now, we see how far your reach extends, which is to say, nowhere at all. It has proved a valuable lesson for me and my allies. Yes, your allies the Pazzi. Is that what this is about? Be careful with your words, Lorenzo. You might attract the wrong sort of attention. Can't go that way then. Perfect. Perfect. Higher. Che bella femmina! Nothing here could possibly be so good. We've got the finest time. Good evening, compagnoniere. To you as well. You! That's right. done the same to save the ones you love yes I would and I have the auditory are not dead I'm still here me Ezio Ezio auditore Nope, nope. Please, I mean no harm to anyone. Don't see you, anxious. I 
think it's best I leave Firenze. Where will you go? My uncle Mario owns a villa near Monteregioni. You're still a wanted man, Ezio. What would you have me do then? I've seen posters all across the district. Tearing them down will help the city forget your face. No doubt the Herald's also inside the public. Bribe them, and they'll speak of other things. Or you could hunt those who bear false witness against you. They traded dignity for coin. Their loss would not be more. Right. Do any of these things, and you should be free to leave. I've added a program for tracking notoriety. This little meter will help you know how far you are between notorious and incognito. Over here. This will help you know if you should watch your actions. It'll also tell you if the notoriety level is part of Ezio's memory or not. Finding new suppliers has paid off, and I pass the savings on to you. Oh. Up and drop. Bentornato, Ezio. Were you successful? Yes. Padre? Ezio, where have you been? They wouldn't let us leave, and Mother... Oh, she hasn't spoken a single word since we left the house. Father will need to sort things out. Where is Father? And Federico? And Petruccio? Hmm? Something's happened. What do you mean? No, it's impossible. Claudia. No, 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 no. I did everything I could, Piccina. <sighs> Listen, right now what matters is getting us all someplace safe. But to do that, I need you to stay focused. Do you understand? Good. Will you watch over mother for me? Then we are ready. Thank you again, for everything. Stay safe, Ezio. Stay vigilant. I suspect the road ahead is yet long. Andiamo. In close. Accidental. 
There's no need to be rude. I... I... I'm sorry. I think... I'm sorry. Fine. Where do you think you're going right now? Smart! Oh, don't stand! Don't stand! want to annoy me. Leave. This hero's luck will hold me back. Why is it locked on? He rules out all the evilest mighty man. He keeps the poor from the mighty man. <laughs> oh, just meant to push, not kill. What is going on here? Sorry. I have to replace. That was from the guild. And Master Bachi is notoriously cheap. Okay. Follow my lead. Higher. I mean no harm to anyone. No, no, no. Oh, What's the matter with you? Oh, 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 you to think I was a fairly noticeable obstacle. Queen, oh, let's do it. Hiring factions. On me. How could this have happened to us? I don't know. Will we ever be back? I don't know. Kui, what let's will do happen it. to our house? I don't know. Were they... Were they given a proper burial? Yes. They were. Arrivederci. I'm gonna... Can I pause?
for now, I want to check something. That. What, um, mission? at this no mission right now. Um Sorry. Playing catch up. Playing catch up. Should be close. Grazie, Dio. Stay close. Okay. Firenze without saying a proper goodbye. Ezio! What do you want, Vieri? So many things. A larger palazzo, two new steeds, a prettier bride. Oh, and yes, your life. My condolences for the loss of your father and brothers. <laughs> what will happen now that there's no one left to help you? I have such wonderful things in store for your mother and sister. I grow tired of this game. Finish him, and do not spare the women. What sorcery is this? <laughs> not sorcery, boy. Skill. Show yourself. As you wish. Here, use this. Kill them! Kill them all!
in the area. You have my thanks. Keep the sword, Ezio. Do I know you from somewhere? Don't you recognize me? It's a me, Mario! Uncle Mario? <clears throat> it's been too long, Yvote. Far too long. I heard what happened in Firenze. Terrible. Come. Let's get you all away from here. Okay. This is wrong. All right. So let's talk. Yes. So, Eat. tell me everything. They executed father for treason. Federico and Petruccio, too. And they came for me. Do you know why? I have no answers, uncle. Only a list of names taken from a man who wished me dead. I still can't believe they are gone. Don't worry. We will make sense of this. I wish I shared your optimism. Come on, keep pace. We're almost there. I think you will find much to like in Monterigioni. I thought Monterigioni was an enemy of Firenze. For now. Next year it will be its friend, the year after its enemy again, and on and on. I cannot keep track, so I have stopped trying. These are honest, hard-working people. Our shops <laughs> are the distance to target. But they're well made and dependable. There is a chapel here too. Okay. The Prete seems a nice enough fellow, but I have never been much of a believer. Did you know the Villa Auditore is almost 200 years old? It was built by my great-grandfather, a strange man who carried all kinds of secrets. Keep your eyes open, and you might discover a few of them yourself. With all the fighting that's been going on, this place has started to get a bit rough around the edges. I wish I could do something about it, but I just don't have the time or money to fix things up. Guess that's life, huh? Bella Antone. Here we are. Casa Dolce Casa. So, what do you think? It's most impressive, Uncle. She's seen better days, I suppose. Believe me, I'd have her shining again if only I had the time. Now that you have had the tour, Nipote, you should go and outfit yourself. My men in the market are expecting you. Return here when you're finished, and we'll begin. Begin? Begin what? I thought you'd come here to train. No, Uncle. I came here to escape Firenze. And I intend to take my family further still. But what about your father? He'd want you to finish his work. What work? My father was a banker. Wait, he did not tell you? I have no idea what you're talking about. Ma che me convini, Giovanni? Where to even begin? Go and fetch the gear in the market. It will give me time to think. But... But that's that. We'll talk more later. Some spending money should you need it. And if you find yourself in need of rest, I've prepared a room for you on the top floor. And we will fetch. Go fetching. Ooh. Go fetch. Hmm. Yeah, I'll go fetch. Armor. I do traditional remedies and the wisdom of the Arabies. <laughs> Wilness awaits. By five. Farewell and swift recovery and Ciao, 
some friends. I fresh caught leeches today. Take us acquired. Um Okay. Now that everything's all caught up. And all that. All that good stuff. Don't worry. We're only staying here for a little while. I don't like it here. I want to go home. I know. This has been Ace. Thank you for watching. This and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.